Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to The Uncertain. In the last episode, um, what did I do? I, ba I guess I basically just explored this place and talked to some people. And uh, I said I'd help Patrick out with his um, problem with the lighting or something. But anyway, I found a flashlight so I can go into the dark room over here. Just got to move this over here and head in here. I need to find some contactors here. Yes, that is what we're doing. Oh, okay. So, can I move? No. I can move the light around, but that's about it. Oh, what, what do these contactors look like? Could you tell me? Give me some sort of indication? Anything that could help me find what it is we're supposed to be looking for. Nothing? Okay. I will just find these things without even knowing what they look like. Is this it? I found one electric contactor. I should look for more in case it is not enough. Okay, so it looks like... I don't know, it looked like it was just a little pile of shit. But, uh, hey, I'm no electrical expert. Maybe that's what it is. Is that one? Second contactor. The task would be easier if I had infrared vision or an item scanner. Yes, it would, but you don't, so why are you talking about it? Is that not just wasting your energy? I mean, that seems rather inefficient for, inefficient for such a robot. It is very inaccurate. Oh, oh, it's a... So that's not actually the contact thing I'm Acrylic looking for. Paint. Ineffective. Only outdated <coughs> robots are covered with this type of paint. Okay, I mean, we didn't just use it for robots, did we? A fire extinguisher. I have no high temperature protection. This device could stop a fire, but it is too bulky to carry around, and besides, it is not functional. Oh, that's a shame. Right, what? We've got to find that one more contact. Isn't that's not it. Sulfate. It is useless to me. Oh, that's a shame. Is it in there? No. Ah, couldn't make this easy for me, could you? Is that it? I think that might be it there. Third contactor. <laughs> it appears intact. Good, good. How many am I supposed to find? An oxygen cylinder. It is empty. Ah, well, at least we've got plenty here. In the room. Although I don't know if you need oxygen, do you? A powder extinguisher. <laughs> it expired six years, eight months, and twelve days ago. Oh, well that's a shame. An empty metal container. Oh good. Seriously, I can't find this final contact. Whatever it is. They said it was just contacts, didn't they? Oh, is there something up here? No, that's just that again. Where is it? Oh, you're right, this would be easier with an infrared scanner. Do I have enough? What's over here? Toolbox. A toolkit. I could bring it along, but I do not think I will be back to the workshop anytime soon. E yeah. But, tools are pretty useful, I'd imagine. A screwdriver. I do not need it right now. No. No you don't. You need a contact. So where the hell is it? Or have we found enough? A fourth contactor. I think this Oh, finally. Enough. I will give these fuses to Patrick. Is it just me, or were those really difficult to see? It might just be me, because I'm quite far from the screen. Plus the screen's quite dark, so... Anyway, Patrick, I've got these for you. Did you find the contactors? Yes. Yes. This is all this I is could all find. I could find. Good. I'm trying to get them now on the tone voice, but it's pointless. Work. I can't. Thank I don't you. care enough to do it. What else can I do while I'm here? Yes. Anything else I could do? Nothing help. for now. Thank you once again. You're most welcome. I am glad to be of help. Yes. Am I though? Oh, hello, Abigail. RT, Nip needs your help. Please speak with him. Okay. Good. <laughs> Good. I'm glad. I'm not going to help him. I want to see him suffer. That's why I said it's good. I hate him. I hate Nick. I hate him so much. Anyway, let's have a chat with Nick. Mm. Ah, bit of squash first. Hello. The robot is missing. Okay, yep. Yeah. Talk. <coughs> I assume you're Nick. Thank you for coming, RT. 
It is good that you joined our organization. Most welcome. Please call Gregory me Stephen. told me that we have all been deliberately misinformed about what happened to the humans. Yes. Although USS Robotics have never approved of humans, I always felt curious about them. I read their books and explored their items that I found. The corporation failed to stop me only because I blocked automatic updates. You are right. Most robots downloaded the malicious update and are now indifferent to humans. Okay. In fact, they alarm the police at the detection of any human or robot who has been in contact with a human. Okay. The fact that the police arrived so quickly at the crash site is unusual. I hope we can figure out what happened. I imagine they got First, shot down. I assume that it was you who led them to the crash, but then I discovered that you did not send an alert to the police. This must mean that you have not been contaminated by the update, and I do not have to interfere with your intellectual block. Thank you. Then again, Gregory will fill in the details. I just wanted to ask for some help. Okay. We are restoring the building's main systems. I fixed the intercom, so now we have the internet. The only way anyone can detect us is if we let them. Ah, that's good. RT, the servers are on the basement level. Could you please start servers number one, three, and four? One, three, and four, okay. And make sure all the nodes are functioning, and activate the connection to the internet. After that, please return here. Oh, with pleasure. Okay. The internet is I where I live, again. so I definitely want it working. Let us go. Down here, I assume. Off we go. Come on, put some spring in your step. Do we need to oil you, perhaps? Will that help? I don't know. I don't know how you work. Maybe it wouldn't help. What's this over here? There's something in the box. Poke it. Let's, let's find out what it is. What's in the box? It is a fuse, but it is broken and will not work. Shit. I'm probably going to need those fuses later, aren't I? Great. Uh, I'm probably going to need the fuses for this thing, aren't I? Servers 1 through... 1, 3, and 4. Uh, is this it? Starting the servers is the highest priority. Well, let's get to it then. Uh, server 1. Not server 2. Server 3. Assuming I'm counting in the right direction. And 4. I started the necessary service. Yay! I'm a genius. Not really. I can open the cover of this console. Well, let's get to it then, shall we? It is missing a fuse. Well, shit. I knew I'd need those fuses. The router should distribute traffic across the network of the entire building, but I cannot start it. I need to find the missing chip that is functional. The chips I have seen are out of order. Oh, great. Now what's in here? It is missing a switch. I need to find it, otherwise I cannot <sighs> finish setting the server. It is probably somewhere nearby. Well, I guess I'm on a little treasure hunt then. Anything in here, perhaps? If I refused to cooperate, I would be disintegrated just like Oh, that. oh I Why see. Why the police robots do that? They must have realized the consequences. The USS updates probably damaged their logic module. <laughs> Probably. Be quite a terrifying world if the government could do that. Then again, I suppose it could be argued they kind of can. There is something in a trash dump. Well, let's pick it up, Mr. Echoey Man. Echoey Robot, I guess. The same switch needed for the switchboard. Good, pick it up. Yoink. Okay. Next, I need to find some fuses, don't I? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm tired. I guess I need to go upstairs for the fuses. <laughs> yep. Couldn't keep it confined to a smaller space, could you? Just to make things slightly easier on me. Why would humans make so many? Okay, okay. Let's open the door. It is locked. Right. Over here. What's over here? It appears that this fuse is still in Yes! Order. I can use it for the server. How many do I need? I think I only need one. But I also need another chip thing, don't I? I found a working fuse for the server. Goody! Now all I need is uh, the, the thing. I don't remember what it was. Don't want to Can't go in there. I don't need that. Don't need that. Oh, I don't know where I'm going or what I need. 
What was it I needed? I don't know, some sort of a... It looked like a little telephone thing or something. Patrick, do you know where I can find one? Let us not distract him. Ugh, fine. Well, I suppose we'll find whatever that last thing is in the next episode. Bye bye